Welcome to 3 Minute Thursdays. 3 Minute Thursdays are a short breakdown of topics that you will see within your flight training here at UND. The goal is for you, the student, to have a better understanding of what it takes to become a safe, professional pilot. Hello, my name is Tyler Lauer. I'm a lead flight instructor here at UND Aerospace. It's my pleasure to bring you this week's Three Minute Thursday as we discuss proper use of flight controls while taxiing. Although you're not flying, how you position the flight controls on the ground is important to maintaining positive directional control of your aircraft. Today, we will review the different wind scenarios and the proper way to position your flight controls as you taxi. If you are taxiing into a direct headwind, wind correction will not be needed. Ailerons and elevators may be neutral. If you are taxiing into a quartering headwind that is either from the left or the right, you should place the upwind aileron into the wind. This means a quartering headwind from the left requires your ailerons to be placed as if you are banking to the left. If a quartering headwind is from the right, the ailerons are placed as if you are banking to the right. Wind coming from behind the aircraft can pose an interesting challenge for pilots. First, we will keep the elevator forward or nose down. This prevents the wind from getting underneath the tail. Second, we will place the ailerons into a dive away position. This means that with a quartering tailwind from the right, you should position your ailerons as if you are banking to the left. If a quartering tailwind is from the left, ailerons should be positioned as if you are banking to the right. Now let's practice the knowledge that we've just learned. In this scenario, we are in a standard taxi to 17 right. ATC has just cleared us to continue taxi and cross 9 or left at alpha. The winds are 210 at 15 knots, placing the headwind component in a quartering headwind from the left. As we take the turn northbound onto alpha, the wind component changes to a quartering tailwind from the left. We now place the flight controls in a dive away position. Today, we reviewed the how and why of crosswind correction while taxiing. Remember these four tips while taxiing. Always take note of the wind direction. Keep an eye on the windsock, turn into the headwind, and dive away from the tailwind. Wind affects the airplane long before the wheels leave the ground. Thank you for watching 3 Minute Thursdays. If you have a topic that you would like to see covered, please comment below. Remember, fly safe, and we'll see you on the flight line. Use the flight controls while tap. Try not to like look at the screen because nothing's weirder than. <laughs> All right, ready?